Why did you try to bury your brother? I owed it to my brother to unlock the house of the dead in which my father and my mother are waiting to welcome him. Polynices has earned his rest. Polynices was a rebel and a traitor. He was my brother. You knew the punishment I had decreed for any person who attempted to give him burial? Yes, I knew the punishment. Did you by any chance act on the assumption that a daughter of Oedipus was above the law? Because if you did, you would have been deeply wrong. No one has a more sacred obligation to obey the law than those who make the law. You are a daughter of lawmakers, a daughter of kings, Antigone. You must observe the law. Had I been a scullery maid washing my dishes, I would have scrubbed the greasy water from my arms and gone out in my apron to bury my brother. What nonsense. Had you been a scullery maid, you would have been satisfied to weep for your brother in your kitchen. But you, you thought that because you were my niece and were going to marry my son, that I shouldn't dare have you killed. You are mistaken. I never doubted for an instant that you would have me put to death. The pride of Oedipus. I can see your father in you and I believe you. Of course you thought that I would have you killed. Your father was like that. You come of people for whom the human vestment is a kind of straitjacket. It cracks at the seams. You spend your lives wriggling to get out of it. Nothing less than a cosy tea party with death and destiny will quench your thirst. But let me tell you, Antigone, those days are over for Thebes. Thebes has a right to a king without a past. My name, thank God, is only Creon. I stand here with both feet firm on the ground. And I have decided that so long as I am king, I will merely devote myself to teaching a little order to this absurd kingdom, if it is possible. Hand you over to be killed? I have other plans for you. You're going to marry Heman. And you're going to give him a sturdy son. And let me assure you, Thebes needs that boy a great deal more than it needs your death. And don't annihilate me with those eyes. I know that you think I'm a brute. But the fact is, I've always been fond of you. And don't forget, the first doll you ever had came from me. Where are you going? You know very well where I'm going. Antigone! Do you realize that if the people of Thebes find out what you have tried to do, that it would be impossible for me to avoid putting you to death? I must go bury my brother! 